Can we just check on the team news first of all? Um, Veltman, uh, Solly March, Webster, are they fit? And is Sanchez back in the squad for Newcastle? No, uh, they can't uh, play. No Veltman, no Webster, no March, uh, and no Robert Sanchez. Uh, we are the same, uh, the same squad of um, Arsenal. Arsenal. Yes, more or less, because. We have to. I have to to think very well uh, in terms of first eleven, in terms of uh, the condition of the players. Uh, we can't lose uh, any player more uh, for the the last four games, uh, and we have we have to think with attention. Is Soli out for the season, and why isn't Sanchez in the squad? Right now? But Soli is injured and he can play. Uh, I don't know uh, of the the last part of the season. I don't know the the, the right time, but uh, at the moment uh, he can't play. Robert, with Robert, we spoke before the Arsenal game, and we decided together. Uh, uh, the, the best solution uh, was uh, to, to stay home. Um, Arsenal on Sunday was incredible. One of Brighton's greatest days in the Premier League. And afterwards, Dennis Undad was saying that you used a motivational Michael Jordan video to fire up the guys. Can you talk a bit about more of that? And will you use it again for Newcastle? No, but... Um, in our time, uh, the, the work of uh, the, the, the coaches uh, is, is bigger, no? Uh, you have to control uh, tactical disposition, uh, um, you have to control the relationship with the media, uh, communication, no? Uh, but the, you have to to work with the head of your players uh, and I think in this part of the season the most important part for of, of my players will be the, the head, the mentality, the, the to be able to accept the, uh, the pressure, the different um, Rhythm di, di partite. Uh, different intensity of games. Uh, Rhythm in senso ogni tre giorni. In terms of uh, we are playing every three day. And we have to be ready because we are fighting for a big, big, big result and we have to, we want to reach our target. Um, can you repeat the Arsenal performance though at Newcastle? When you beat Manchester United recently, you followed it with, with Everton. So can you repeat Arsenal at Newcastle? Pensi di poter ripetere la performance con l'Arsenal contro il Newcastle perché dopo quella bella vittoria contro il United ha dato un certo gesto di calo. Yes, is a uh, is our target um, to play another big game in the in the same way we played in Arsenal uh, because the big team play uh, in the same way after three days, after four days, after seven days. And we have to be ready to forget the last game and to restart from the clean head. You said after Arsenal that uh, Caicedo and uh, McAllister could be leaving in the summer. So should Brighton fans now accept that this is possibly their last? No, I didn't say like this, I, I said uh, can be the possibility to lose some big player uh, like Casedo, maybe McAllister, Mitoma, I don't know, but uh, uh, we are Brighton and I, I know the, the, policy, policy. the policy of 
uh, our club, my club, you know, uh, and we have to be um, ready to to bring another good players with the with the the right characteristic, the right condition uh, of our club, you no. Know? And it's one of those players, um, Mahoud Dahoud of Borussia Dortmund, because everyone is talking about this player coming to Brighton right now. But uh, I know very well Dahoud, but uh, he's not uh, official, no. And at the moment, he's not official yet, and uh, we will speak about him. Uh, uh, Later in the next in the next uh, press conference or I don't know. Sounds like he's coming. Yes, because we have not secret and I like him and I would like to work with him. Um, can you just talk a bit about his qualities and what he will give to Brighton? Brighton? You can see him in uh, Wise Scout in YouTube uh, <laughs> where you want, but uh, He's not my player uh, yet, and uh, you have to speak uh, only if you want. I explain you Bill Gilmore, McAllister, Ayari, but the other players I, I don't want to speak. Okay, just finally from me, um, Sunday was so good um, for Brighton for you. How much did you enjoy it? And looking back on it now, where does that rank for you? That we're going to della giornata. Se adesso guardi con gli occhi di oggi quella giornata. Quale giornata? Quella di domenica contro la. No, no, I forget um, everything. Really? The Arsenal game? Yes, yes. Thank you. Chris. Hello, Berto. Um, some celebration from you against Arsenal. How are you needs? Come stanno le tue ginocchia dopo l'esultanza? Very well. I'm ready to replace another time. <laughs> um, and what thoughts did you take away from that game, though? Because it was such an impressive performance. Cosa ti porti via da quella prestazione? Perché è stata molto, molto convincente. Sincerely? The reaction after uh, defeat uh, with uh, Everton. Mm. I I think the the best part of the the last game uh, was the the reaction, the mentality, the, because you can lose in sport in football. You can lose. And sometimes you can lose in a bad way, you know. Uh, you can you can spend a, a very terrible day, but you have to react. Ready to react. And you have to be ready to react and uh, to to show your uh, your mentality. And how important is Jason still becoming to you? in terms of dictating the style of play that you're going to do or the attack that you're just about to start? I see he's crucial, it's not important, it's crucial for us. Uh, he's one, we, we are playing with one player more and he has a big personality, uh, he has a big quality and uh, he's right to play with us, with me. And in terms of looking ahead to Newcastle, what do you make of the job that Eddie Howe has done since joining them from Bournemouth? Come consider il lavoro di Eddie Howe nella tua che sta facendo? Great. He's doing a incredible job. Uh, they deserve to play in Champions League. They are very strong team. Uh, I think uh, it's very tough game, but not for uh, for Brighton, for ev everyone, for every team. Uh, but uh, I have to repeat uh, always the the same. No, uh, we are fighting for a history target, and if we want to reach the historic target, we have to to make historic results because this year we won two times uh, against Chelsea uh, we won 3-0 uh, with Liverpool we, we won 3-0 uh, in Emirates Stadium and we are uh, winning incredible games but 
to reach the incredible target, you have to win incredible game, no? And just finally from me, you mentioned that um, Sanchez won't be involved in the squad for Arsenal, uh, sorry, Newcastle. Um, is he involved with first team training at the moment? Um, he decided uh, everything. Robert decide and at the moment is like this. So he's just uh, not with the first team at the moment, or he's just not. Yes, but because he wanted this way, not me, not Claire. Thank you. Well, can I just check on Julio and Cesar? Is he okay? Because he came off with a bad leg. Yes, yes, it is okay, but. Um, in terms of the first 11, I'm losing. Uh, uh, no, sonno. Um, my sleep. My sleep yeah. to, to decide the best uh, first 11. We can't uh, lose any player more, uh, we can't uh, take any risk, and um, we start to win the game tomorrow for sure, but we have to think uh, we have uh, four games in 12 days and we have to to know this, this, uh, uh, these things. You have four games, you know that two wins will guarantee Europa League. How nice is it to have it in your hands, your destiny? It's important because uh, we can decide uh, uh, our uh, our destiny and uh, our future. But uh, we know we the the, the way is long, uh, is uh, still difficult. Uh, it's not uh, so easy to to qualify for Europe League because uh, to qualify for Europe League we have to win two games and we will play uh, against uh, three. Big teams, Newcastle City and uh, Aston Villa, and uh, we will play against uh, Southampton, and it will be, uh, I think, the 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 most uh, difficult game. The You're going to Newcastle. There's always a special atmosphere at their stadium. Your away form this season has been very good. What do you put that down to? Eight wins away from the Alex. Otto vittorie lontane dall'Amex, quindi un punto in più a tuo favore sapendo che vai a giocare in uno stadio molto caldo come quello di Newcastle. But for me it's an honor to, to play in, uh, in, in this stadium, no? And I'm looking forward to, to play uh, because um, the passion of the fans is uh, the best of football. Uh, and, and it will be uh, nice to to give the possibility to play, uh, and we 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 play to win for sure. So it's the same home and away. You still have the same strategy. Not the same respect yeah. for the Southampton and uh, for the Man City, but the same. Uh, Dream the same uh, idea, the same uh, reason uh, we we are on the pitch, and we are on the pitch to, to play. We are on the pitch to enjoy. We are on the pitch to win. Thank you. Um, written.